uh, everybody to uh, this uh, uh, workshop. Um, so uh, before we start uh, with the uh, um, with the talks, uh, we want to spend a few words on uh, the, the idea behind this workshop and uh, um, about where this uh, um, uh, meeting is virtually held, so at ICTP. So this workshop was uh, sort of uh, born uh, around the conversation that we were having um, during uh, the winter school at ICTP that we organized in December. Uh, if you uh, were not able to participate, you can find most of the lectures uh, online. And uh, uh, with Mercedes, Matteo, Silvia, and others, we were sort of discussing about the, the, the processing uh, limiting diversity in natural community. So we all know that we live in a highly diverse uh, world, and uh, um, we know that many processes, processes uh, shape the diversity, but somehow we, we lack uh, good, uh, good uh, methods and a good understanding of what processes really limit uh, the diversity that we observe in, uh, in natural community and how to study quantitatively this natural community. So uh, we decided to organize this uh, workshop to have a discussion around these teams and we identified a group of uh, um, uh, speakers, both uh, on uh, experiments, trying to push experimentally the limits of diversity and working on theory, trying to understand uh, um, quantitatively uh, uh, in a conceptual framework what these limits are. So this is the idea uh, of the workshop and um, sort of in term of, terms of uh, format, what we'd like to have is uh, to have a lot of discussions around the, the talks. Uh, so we ask the speakers to uh, um, leave time for, for questions and we are reserving some slots to having discussion all together and, um, and uh, to have discussion in uh, breakout rooms. So I'll tell you more about that uh, later. So before we start, uh, I uh, want to uh, introduce the uh, other uh, uh, organizer of this workshop. Uh, Mercedes Pasqual, Silvia Zauli, and uh, Matteo Marsili. And I want to uh, leave the word to Matteo to say uh, a few things about uh, ICTP, where this meeting is virtually held. Okay, thank you very much, uh, Jacopo. So welcome everybody to this meeting. So uh, many of you maybe know already ICTP. Uh, hopefully some of you have been uh, to ICTP in Trieste. But for those of you who didn't, uh, maybe just two words to remind uh, what ICTP is. Uh, is an uh, international center for theoretical physics, uh, and it has been created uh, uh, by uh, the former um, uh, Abdul Salam, and um, with a dual mission uh, to pursue excellence in re uh, research uh, and to make it available and to bridge uh, any uh, uh, divide that may um, prevent uh, uh, people, especially from a, a developing country, to access uh, the frontier of science. And indeed, uh, uh, he was uh, in his famous sentence uh, says that uh, uh, scientific uh, culture is the common heritage of all uh, uh, humankind. And um, and so uh, in last uh, years, uh, since uh, uh, 2014, uh, ICTP has launched uh, a new section in uh, quantitative life sciences, uh, which recognizes the idea that uh, theoretical physics uh, has expanded uh, much more broadly uh, with respect to the original domains of, uh, um, of uh, theoretical physics. Uh, and, uh, and indeed, uh, uh, this, is, uh, uh, this workshop is part of the activity that we pursue in the quantitative life science section. So um, having said this, uh, um, I welcome you again to this, uh, to this meeting. Uh, usually uh, in IC at ICTP, we have these meetings in person, and usually we have uh, 
I mean, in non-COVID years, uh, we have uh, around uh, 50 or, or so uh, such meetings, uh, workshops, schools, and conferences. But of course, uh, uh, this year we are limited to, and, and we also have many more uh, activities where uh, uh, researchers from uh, the south and the north, uh, the east and the west, uh, come and visit us and interact and collaborate. Uh, to advance uh, the frontier of science. So uh, again, uh, welcome you to virtually to ICDP. And uh, then maybe I'll leave the word to Mercedes uh, for, to, for a welcome. Yes, thank you, Matteo. Thank you, Jacopo. It is indeed uh, very nice to be here, not as nice as being in Trieste. I, I will confess I, I am a big fan of ICTP. And before the Quantitative Biology Initiative, the Institute has played uh, uh, a role in theoretical ecology. It has a long history of workshops and schools. And I took some of those as a graduate student. They were very exciting uh, events and uh, they brought together people from all over the world. Um, and so it's a pleasure to be here. And thank you all uh, the, the people participating. And I would say that, of course, there has been a lot of theory on community, in community ecology on issues of coexistence and, uh, and diversity, of course. Um, but I think this is a very exciting time because of the focus uh, on what we can call, and we will hear a lot about assembly, uh, that is the dynamical process of, uh, of building these communities. And I think there is a lot of uh, interesting theory. And, and what is new from this perspective is that uh, we have for a long time looked at, looked at communities and deter, uh, sort of say something about their structure or consequences for dynamics and function, but not in terms of uh, the dynamical assembly, um, that, that perspective. Also, we have very interesting approaches now uh, at the interface with data. And I would say that one topic, uh, the sort of focus of this workshop is a little bit in an area that I'm uh, very interested in, which is the, the very high diversity or these limits to diversity. So uh, we may be in regimes that are somewhat different from the usual understanding of coexistence. And uh, that is at least a question in my mind and, and one I hope we will gain some uh, insights uh, from the interesting talks this week. So welcome again, and I hope next time we will be in person in, uh, in Trieste. We all hope uh, the same, I think. Um, so before we start with the first uh, session, I want to remind uh, or actually to tell uh, a few uh, rules on how to uh, ask questions and interact. Uh, so during the talks, if you have uh, any question, you can either uh, type this question in the chat or you can use the raise and tool of Zoom. So you go to the participant links, links, the participant list, and then there are three dots and then there is a raise and uh, uh, button and you can use that. And uh, the speaker will uh, ask if there are uh, questions during the talk and then we'll give you uh, the, the, the possibility to ask your question. And then uh, we'll try to use a sort of the same approach after the, 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 the talks to ask questions or to have uh, a discussion. So uh, we would like to have this not as a sort of series of talk, but more as a um, discussion where we really um, express our, uh, uh, our opinion, our thoughts. So uh, I think this is more difficult to do uh, online than uh, live, but please don't hesitate to share your uh, uh, most uh, uh, oddly formed uh, idea and don't try to share only, don't be sort of shy to share uh, thoughts that are not fully formed. So, so I think it's a good uh, uh, environment to really be free to, to express your wildest uh, ideas about diversity. So with that, I'll uh, give you give the word to uh, to Silvia, who will chair the first uh, session. Okay, 